for Trust, dance edition, we choose to do a social game for three reasons. The first one is we absolutely need to recruit massively in the emerging countries. Social game is a way to touch uh, and attract massively a lot of young people uh, who will play with us. The second reason is because we want to recruit locally. We believe in the potential of people everywhere and we want to be local with our consumer, our customers, our stakeholders, our employees and then we want to recruit 80% of people locally at least, everywhere. And to do that, to have a social game that we can customize, uh, you will see the, uh, your avatar will be in any uh, nationality, any culture, will help us to be sure that we are uh, local and global at the same time in the way we recruit. And the third reason is obvious. I mean, we recruit a lot of young people and the social game is part of life now. And we want also to, to show them, to share with them that Danone is an interactive world. So just let's just start and have fun interacting before on the so social game. It's built on the values of Danone it's built on the social and economic dual project, which is the heart of the genetic, of the DNA of Danone. What it means? It means that we strongly believe, with 40 years of experience, that you cannot develop sustainably the economic performance if you don't develop the social performance. And you always need to converge between the economic and social. Sometimes you have to balance. But in all cases, a sustainable business is made of economic and social. And by social, I mean the employees, and I mean the society, the community, the environment. So to learn through a game that the heart of the way we do business is to balance and make converging economic and social is to be inside that in a way. So it's why this uh, trust game has been ot ot uh, totally designed for and by Danone. Why employee branding is uh, growing in the world? Uh, in emerging countries, it's quite obvious. There's a lot of competition for talent in fast-growing uh, economies. So a way to develop employee branding is a way to, to show your uniqueness compared to other companies. But also in Europe or in other uh, not growing uh, uh, geographies, you have to think that maybe we recruit less people in companies but we need people who have a real leadership to make the difference. At Dadon, we strongly believe that people make the difference. So the women and the men in the company that will be the right leaders for tomorrow will be key. So it's why in Europe, as well in emerging countries, uh, attracting the right people, it's really key for the future.